What's up, gang? gang? Today we're gonna be doing super cool uh, DIYs, really cool stuff. <laughs> what is up, boys? It's uh, it's Kevin here, bringing you guys a new video. Today we're gonna be looking at quite possibly the worst pranks on YouTube. And yes, of course, I'm talking about Troom Troom. Troom Troom is uh, DIY mixed in with a, a prank. They make really weird videos. I'm not sure how it's a prank. I've watched some of the video. I've not seen a prank yet. That's what all their videos are. They're just really dumb videos, horrible acting, horrible everything. Let's get right into it. You think this guy has friends? Like, he acts in Troom Troom videos. You think he has friends outside of Troom Troom? Did, like, all of his friends and family, like, disassociate with him because of him getting a job at Troom Troom? Professor Beaker is on the verge of an amazing breakthrough. The mad scientist invented a one-of-a-kind biological robot, and now he is going to test it. And here is the invention itself, Prototype Susie. You think he, uh... You think he, like makes out with it i mean i know i know i would i mean who said that she can successfully hold a cup which means that the strength of her upper arm limbs is good excellent now dude no way so this person's saying that just because you can hold a cup the strength of your arms are good i mean no 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 Excellent. But the most amazing thing is that Susie is alive. She moves and smiles. And it seems that she wants to eat. Well, scientist, give some food to your invention. Beaker brings a little serving of noodles for the robot. Add an egg yolk to- So now I'm, they're about to tell us how to make a ch little Chinese dish. I'm not sure why anyone would ever need this information nor try to do this. and fill it with mini noodles. Stick in little toothpicks like mini chopsticks. Imagine like getting that for Halloween, going up to a house, saying trick or treat, you know, doing the whole ordeal or whatever, and then getting a little thing filled with Chinese noodles. What would your expression, my expression, I'd probably like freaking, um, you know, uh, you know, like, burn their house down or something. This tiny serving of noodle is not enough for the biological robot. Susie feels the taste of carbs. And now she uses electricity and asks for more. Hurry up, Beaker. The scientist made a truly royal serving for his invention. This will be enough for a whole army of robots. A tomato, eggplant. I'm gonna need to know this because I'm definitely gonna make a, a toddler sized dish of Chinese food. What? That is enough of that video for now. We're actually beginning looking at a new Super Fuego video called 14 Weird Ways to Sneak Food into Class slash Back to School Pranks. In the intro scene, you see a girl playing with a burger as if the teacher won't notice that. Do you think it's a colored pencil case? It's actually not. Let's see what's inside. It's actually not. Let's see what's inside. We'll need a colored pencil case. Cut off the top part of a- And then they're gonna explain how to do this. When I believe it's pretty basic, you- <laughs> You get all the colored pencils out, and you put a chocolate bar in. What more is there to explain? It seems my friend can't open her colored pencil case. I offer her mine, but she isn't going to draw. There's a dream of a sweet tooth inside her case. Oh, heck. Oh, heck. Oh, darn tootin. Miss <laughs> Smith has found my secret stash of chocolate in my freaking colored pencils case. Not again. Do you dream of a portion of french fries or a juicy cheeseburger during your long classes? I mean, I know the only thing I dream about is a portion of french fries and a good old juicy hamburger. Take bright notebooks shaped like a pack of french fries and a cheeseburger. She thinks we've got McDonald's here. We assure her it's nothing like that. It's just our weird notebooks. We change the notebooks for the real snacks. Mmm, what crispy french fries and a tasty cheeseburger. Are you eating again? Oh yes, it's your notebooks. Okay, continue writing, girls. They are so creative. 
they are so creative. You know, sneaking food into my class after I've told them not to for so long. I've been teaching for 20 years and get minimum wage. And honestly, I just don't think my life is going anywhere. I'm not married. I've, n I've never had a long-term boyfriend. And these kids, you know, I, try, I do my best and they, they just treat me like garbage. I think that's going to be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Feel free to do so. Make sure to check out my merch. Link in the description. If you guys do really enjoy this video, then I will try some of the Troom Troom pranks. I can't believe this is what my life has come to.